No, a Google redirect to Bing isn't normal, and especially if it's happening all the time, along with a bunch of new intrusive ads and weird ass pop-ups. Yeah, bad news, you've actually got a browser hijacker issue. But good news, I can show you how to remove it. There are actually two ways to go about it, getting an antivirus or learning how to get rid of Google redirects to Bing manually. The quickest and easiest way to remove Bing from Chrome is with an antivirus piece of software. And it'll also fix Google Chrome search engine changing to Bing while also getting rid of all other types of malware. So, yep, I've got totally V for Windows set up on my PC. Now I've checked its strong ability to battle adware many times before. And it also showed good malware detection scores and all that independent testing. And on top of that, I went ahead and put an exclusive Total AV deal in the description. So if you're looking to get rid of the Bing virus fast, well, might as well get the best possible deal that you can, right? Okay, anyway, once you have the app, run a full scan right here. Okay, it might take a bit depending on how much stuff you have on your PC. Yeah, I have way too much. But once it's done, learning how to get rid of Google redirects to Bing is done by simply following the antivirus instructions. Got it? Good, okay. Now, the next step to fully get rid of the Google redirect to Bing problem is to reset your browser. On Google Chrome, click on these three vertical dots in the corner and choose Settings. On the side, find and click Reset Settings. Confirm it, and once it's done, just restart the browser. You should have no more of that default browser change to Bing nonsense. Okay, so yeah, this is a Chrome tutorial, but if you use another browser, you can pretty much follow a similar pattern and reset it via the settings. Now, if you're wondering, how do I remove Bing from Chrome manually? Well, let me say something right away. Manual removal will not guarantee the same result as an antivirus. And even after following all the steps, you should still run an antivirus scan. I mean, nowadays, malware is made smart and hides where you won't find it. So if you don't wanna take any chances, yeah, I would say get the proper tools to get rid of it. All right, well, to try your hand at reversing the Google Chrome search engine change to Bing, the first thing you need to do is open up the control panel, search in the start menu, then click on programs and uninstall any suspicious applications that you see in there. Next up, you're gonna need to clear any scheduled tasks that might be malicious. For that, in the Windows menu, look up Task Scheduler and yeah, open it. Now from here, navigate to the Task Scheduler library. And in the list, if you see any task identified as unknown, suspicious, or something with a random name like Chrome Policy, just right click it and select Delete. And to remove Bing Search Virus, you'll also need to clear malicious files. To do that, search Run in the Windows search bar and in the text box, enter App Data with percentage signs on each side, just like this. There you go. Okay, click OK. And then between these folders, delete unknown ones with names like Energy, Blue, Market, or anything similar. Okay, now we're almost at the end here. Open up your browser because an important step in learning how to remove Bing from Google Chrome is getting rid of unwanted extensions. Click on the three dots in the corner and then more tools and choose extensions. Search for anything there that should not be in there and click the remove button to get rid of them. Now from here, follow the steps we went over to reset your browser and feel free to use the timestamps in the video to go back, <laughs> so convenient. And as mentioned before, even if you follow all the manual steps on how to remove Bing search from Chrome, you should still run an antivirus scan, especially if the Chrome Bing search problem persists. Malware is a nasty piece of work and there is a chance that the problem could be hiding even deeper in your OS. So to fully remove it, yeah, you're gonna need a proper tool. An antivirus will not only remove the problem, but also protect your system from future threats. All right, that's it. I hope you succeed, or at least will succeed soon, to remove Bing Chrome adware. Let me know in the comments if you did or didn't or had any problems. And don't forget to drop a sub or like to help keep us going and making these helpful videos. All right, thanks for watching, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one.